I have five o'clock, so we are going to warm up, get started, get moving. Go ahead and begin with some good mornings right here. Hip hinge, flap back down, squeeze to the back of your legs as you come up. Nice girls, yep. Big hip hinge, squeeze through the back of the legs. Nice job. Keep going, pull that belly button in. Make sure that back stays flat, roll back your shoulders. No arching. Let's do two more, then we're gonna go to calf raises. All right, calf raises up onto your toes. Feel free to keep your hands here. If you want a little bit more, a little extra balance, put your hands up. Try not to let those heels tap all the way down. If you can, keep them just like a centimeter above the ground and come back up. Good job. Keep your core tight, squeeze your glutes, stay tall. Awesome job. We got like 10 more seconds of calf raises. All right, from here we're going to the leg swings. One leg swinging forward and backward. If your balance is off, make sure you're pulling your core in. If you fall a little bit, just come back to it. It happens to all of us. Go ahead and switch legs. Nice job. All right, from here, we're going to switch legs again, and this time go side to side. Yeah, this one's a little bit more tricky for me with balance. I really have to pull my core in here. Look at one spot ahead of you. All right, switch sides. About five more seconds. All right, arm circles, nice big ones. Take it forward. And take it backwards. Dynamic hugs. Give yourself a nice big hug and open up through the chest. Nice, couple more. From here, we're gonna go into side shuffles. Get down nice and low in your squat. Shuffle over about three times. You can tap down if you'd like, and then over to the other side. Start getting that heart rate up a little bit. Stay low the whole time. Your knees should be bent the whole time. Nice, low squat. If you're up here, that's not working. Down here. Nice, stay low, don't come up. Roll the shoulders back, look ahead of you. Good, good, good. Pick up your pace a little bit. Your heart rate should be coming up now. Couple more. One more each side. All right, come to your mat. We're going in a push up to child's pose. You can stay on your knees as you're warming up if you'd like. Push up, push back to child's pose. Push up, back to child's pose. Good job, keep going. Take about 15 more seconds. Keep working.
All right, go ahead and make your way up. Let's go into bun kickers, getting the heart rate up. You always have the option to stay here. If you're ready to run right here. If you're here, use your arms. Even if you're running, you can use those arms right here. Elbows staying close to your body. Nice job, take it to high knees here or running it. Nice job, get those knees all the way up, stepping or running, get them up, up, up. Ten more seconds. Two, one, finish it up with jacks here or jump it. Nice girls. Get those arms all the way up overhead. 10 more seconds. Three, two, one, great job. Keep your feet moving the whole time as I go over our first round right here. So a little jog right here. We're gonna go into a lot of strength work today with some cardio worked in. First step is our strength. If you haven't got your equipment yet, you'll need dumbbells and a heavy kettlebell. Starting out is gonna be bent over fly. We're gonna do each of these moves that I show you for 30 seconds. Go through the list and repeat three times. There's only three of them. Hinge forward, back is flat. I'm hinged over nice and far, not right here. All the way over, fly. Big beach ball arms. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. After that, lateral raises. If you need to lighten your weight, feel free. You might need a lighter weight than what you grabbed. Lateral raises are right here. After that, you're just going into push-ups. Take it a couple up onto your toes if you can. Each of these are gonna be for 30 seconds. That was my bad for not telling you to grab lighter weights. That's on me. If somebody wants my fives, take them. You're welcome to them. Get ready, we're gonna go in just a couple seconds. First of those bent over flies. Hinging right here. All right, three, two, one, begin. 30 seconds. We only get a 10 second transition in between. So get ready to go. Bent over fly, stay bent over. Look down towards the ground. You're halfway. You got it, you got it. Bend over a little bit more. Flat back, five seconds. Beach ball arms the whole time. Squeeze shoulder blades together. Time, get ready for lateral raises. Switch your weights, lighter weights, lateral raise right here. Three, two, one, begin. Right here, my elbows are not locked but they're not super bent either. Just nice and soft, up to shoulder height, back down. Knees aren't locked either. Nice girls. You live stream girls, I don't have any weights in my hand because I'm keeping it low impact since it's not my workout right now, but you pick up those weights girls. It's all about you. That's time, drop those weights. You're gonna get ready for push-ups. Drop the weights, that's time. Get down on your mat. We're getting ready for push-ups. Ready? Begin, 30 seconds of push-ups. Your best ones. If you can do two on your toes first, do them, then drop to your knees. Good, good, good. Don't forget about that halves the option if you're transitioning from knees to toes. Go down on your toes, drop to knees, up on knees. I promise this is what got me to toe push-ups. Five more seconds, almost there. Two, one, good, good, good. Shake it out, shake it out. We're going back to the top with bent over flies. Okay, pick up those weights. Not too much of a break, you know. 
Okay, three, two, one, begin. Nice flat back. We should really be bent over. Squeeze shoulder blades together. Squeeze it right here. Beach ball arms, they're not straight. They're not straight, they're bent. Like you have a beach ball in your arms. 10 more seconds. Lower your weights if you need for lateral raises. They're coming up. Ready? Let's go. Belly button the spine, soft knees, raising the shoulder height back down. Nice. Yes, you can. You are doing great. Halfway. Great posture. Good, good. Five more seconds. That's time. Good job. Drop those weights. Push up. Get down to your mat. We go in five more seconds. Try one on your toes if you can. That have the option. Begin. Try it on your toes and drop to your knees. If you're not getting close down to the ground, go back to your knees. You can always go to a box. If those knee push-ups are really challenging, I want you to go to a box. If you're at home, your countertop, your coffee table, something to elevate your hands up on. That's how we get stronger, building from where we're at. Almost there, that's time. Shake it out, back to the top one more time. Get those weights ready for bent over fly, starting in five seconds. Three, two, one, begin. Remember the slight bend in your elbows, guys. It's not a straight arm, bend in your elbows. You got it. Almost there, a couple more seconds. That's time. Drop your weight. Lateral raises are next. If you need to lighten them, go ahead. We go in five seconds. Last time with this one. Ready, go. These ones, their arms are straight. Good, just not locked in the elbow. Nice job. Tall posture, roll your shoulders back. Good, good. Yes, good breath. Exhale when it's hard. Good job. You have five more seconds. You got this. Almost there. Time. That's time, girls. Drop your weights. We've got push ups next, and then we move on. Get ready. Three, two, go. Begin. Good, good, good. Yes, chest down, nice and low. As low as you can to the ground. Get really low, you're doing great. If you can't get down there on those knees, again, elevate yourself. Build up that strength so that soon you'll be able to. Remember 45 degree angles, arms like an arrow. Almost there, two, one, time. Good job, girls. Okay, you can stay there. We've got two core moves. First up is crunches, you know them right here. If you wanna take it to a full setup, be my guest. And then you've got ankle reaches. We're gonna tap our ankles. I do not want your ankles up here by your booty because then you don't have to reach. Make sure they're out far enough that you have to reach. Big bend in the side body to get there. 30 seconds, two times through this time. Crunches are first. Three, two, one, begin. You got it, you got it. If you're crunching, try to pick up that pace. 
Nice, fast crunches. Make that core work. Halfway. Don't pull on your neck if your hands are behind your head, your elbows are open wide. You got it, five more seconds. Two, one, time, great. Ankle reaches, ankles out nice and far. We reach for them by bending in our side body. Begin. Reach, reach all the way. Oh, those obliques are on fire. I hope yours are too. Good job. Keep reaching all the way. Halfway. Go, go. Breathe. Don't hold your breath. All the way. Last couple seconds. Two, one. Good. Shake it out. Rest just a second. We go to crunches in five seconds. Three, two, one. One, crunches, let's go. 30 seconds again. You got it. Halfway. Chin off chest. Five seconds left. And time. All right, ankle reaches. Ready? Three, two, one. Begin. Reach all the way for him. Good, good, good. Reach, reach, reach. Reach, reach. You got it, girls. Good, good. You look good in the gym. Keep going. You only have five seconds to go you can go all the way two one that's time great job we've got new moves all right go ahead and make your way to your feet two new moves we're going to do these ones three times through these are lower body moves first up is going to be cossack lunges these are a little bit different nice wide stance Sink down into your lunge. It's okay for your toes to come up a little bit. Weight is into your heels. My knee comes over my toes slightly because the way my body is, but my weight is in my heels the whole time. If you feel pain in your knee, make sure that your weight is in your heels. Sink all the way down, side to side, hold a weight. After that, we've got deadlifts. This is where you want that heavy kettlebell or your heaviest dumbbells at home. You know your deadlifts, hinging down, squeezing all the way back up. Okay, those two, 30 seconds each move. Pick up a weight for your Cossack lunges first. Are we ready? Looks like it. Let's go, starting now. I want you to stay low. Don't come up here, stay low. Side to side, low. Wait into your heels. Take your time. You've got 10 more seconds. Way to use the mirror, ladies, I love it. Five more seconds, stay low, stay low. Shoulders back, look up the heel. Time. Okay, deadlift, get the heavy weight, the heavy kettlebell, those heavy dumbbells, whatever you got. Ready? Let's go. Flat back. Squeeze through the glutes to come up. We're not in a wide leg. Right here, right here. Good, good. A little bit more, ladies. Closer together. My in-person girls, a little bit closer together. There you go. Good. Roll your shoulders back. No arching in the back. Nice job. That's time. Good, good. Okay, drop that weight. Cossack lunges are next. Going back and forth between these two. Ready? Let's go. Remember to stay low. Don't come up. 
So hold 30 seconds. Stay as low as you can. The toes on the straight leg. Come up. Halfway. 10 more seconds. Look ahead of you. Roll your shoulders back. Wide stance. Time. Good job. Deadlift. Get your weight ready. Three, two, one, begin. Remember, feet here. This is about hip distance apart. Yep. Good, good, good. As low as you can get, but you should not be rounding in the back. Keep those shoulders back the whole time. Good, good, soft knees, no locking out those knees. You've got 10 more seconds. Good, I love how you're taking your time. If you need to, if you know this move, you've got it down, you can speed it up. That's time, good job. Contact lunges, this is our last time with this one. All right, ready? Begin. Wide legs, nice and wide. Give yourself plenty of room to sink down. Way to pick up that weight. Look ahead of you. Nice, nice, less than 10 seconds. Keep it going. Five seconds. Weight in your heel, not in the toes. Time. Good, good. Trade it out for your heavy weight. Last time with these deadlifts. Ready? Go, begin. Flat back the whole time. If you've been in Kaya for a while and you know these, I want you to take up the pace a little bit. Get more in. If you're still learning, or maybe you have an injury, take your time, of course. 10 more seconds. Five seconds left. Time, great job. Drop those weights. Two more core moves here. Go ahead and make your way to your mat if you'd like while you're listening. We've got leg drops first. You can do single leg. You can do double leg as low as you can without your low back coming up off the ground. After that, fall ups. Okay, 30 seconds each. Ready? Begin two times through. Leg drops first. Go ahead and start. Good, good, good. Head is on the mat. Neck on the mat. Look at the ceiling. Good. If you feel it in your low back, don't come up so high. Or I mean, don't come down so low, come all the way up. 10 more seconds. Good, good, good. You can have a little bend in your knee if you need to, to protect your back. Time, good job. Shake it out, we go to ball ups real quick. Three, two, one, let's go, ball ups. Hug those knees all the way back out. You can do a single knee too. If you want more challenge, hover those legs above the mat. Don't let them drop down. Good job, halfway. Keep breathing. Five seconds left. And time. All right, back to the top leg drops. Three, two, one, begin. Keep that low back down, single leg or double leg. Good job. You got it. If that low back's coming up, don't drop down too low. Keep going. Five seconds left. 
Almost there, time. All right, ball ups, then we move on. Three, two, one, let's go, ball ups. Right to it. Hug those knees, one or two. Hover if you want more. Your best level, you know where you're at. Be honest with yourself and work hard. 10 more seconds. Good, good, good. Almost there. Five seconds. Good, good. Hug those knees all the way. Slowly release down. That's time. Way to go. Okay. Cardio. Couple options. In person, it's hot. So you have choices. You can go out for a large lap. If you say, no, it's 100 degrees out, I'm inside. 300 jump rope. Yes, 300. Zero, zero. You have five minutes. You can take a break where you need to come back to it. My in person girls. Or in person, I already spoke to you. Live stream, 300 jump rope. When you are done with your run or your jump rope, you are in a bridge hold until the time is over. Your bridge hold is right here. I am squeezing my butt all the way up. Hold a weight here if you can. Okay. If you don't know the large lap, go ahead and follow it. Do you know the large lap? It's, it's all out to the right, all the way around. Absolutely. All right, girls, ready? Begin. We got five minutes, plenty of time to do this. A non jumping option. Nice job. Keep those elbows in close to the body and those jump reps. Small, small flick of the wrist. 300. If you need to come out of it and come back, do it. Do it. You've got plenty of time. Remember, bridge hold when you're done. Good girls, yes, good pace. Try to stick with this pace the whole time. Good, good, live stream, stick with that jump rope. If you trip on it, just come back. It happens to me all the time. Just come right back. If you keep tripping on it, Keep those elbows in close. Make sure that it's a small little flick of the wrist. You're not all the way out here, just right here. We're 90 seconds in. Plenty of time to get those jump rope in. When you're done, bridge hold. Great job. Good, remember to keep that core tight the whole time. Squeeze the pelvic floor, pull it in. Great work. We're about halfway through this. You're killing it. Way to keep moving. Always break if you need and come just right back to it. Nice job. Nice. 
All right, girls. Nice job. Nice job. When you're done, bridge hold. Bridge hold. Add a weight to your hips if you can. Push through your hip. Push through your heels. Squeeze the butt. Hold it up here. Try to hold it up until we're all done with this. If you need to come out, just come right back to it. Try to stay up. We're here for just about one more minute, just over a minute left. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Add that weight to your hips if you can. About 45 more seconds here. We're holding for 30 more seconds. Don't forget to breathe. Push those hips up a little higher. Squeeze out those glutes a little bit more. We might be coming out of it because we're getting tired. Squeeze, hold them up. You only have 10 more seconds. You got it. Keep squeezing. Last few seconds. Time. Good. Shake it out. Get a drink of water if you need. And then we are moving on. Go ahead and drink your water while I explain the next round. Same as before, 30 second strength moves three times through. Bent over row is first. Nice bend, just like before, but instead of the fly, we're keeping those elbows in nice and close right here. Lower down slow, squeeze up, lower down. After that, we've got bicep curls. Keep those elbows in, open all the way down each time. And then after that, tricep push up. Elbow staying nice and close the whole time with your push up. All the way down, all the way back up. You can do them on a box, an elevated surface at home, whatever you have. We're going to go through that three times, 30 seconds each. First step is bent over row. Get your weights ready. We are going. Okay, five seconds. Two, one, begin. Bent over row, elbows super close to your body. Slowly lower down, bring them back up. Slowly low down, lower down. You got this. Keep those elbows in close. 10 more seconds, good job. Nice, deep bend, flat back. Five more seconds. And time, go ahead and get ready for bicep curls. Um, shake out your arms if you need. And then pick up your weights again. We're getting ready to go. Three, two, one, bicep curls right here. Remember, open up all the way down each time. If you can't open up all the way down, then maybe consider lowering your weight a little bit. It's better to do them correctly then to push too heavy and not work the full range of your muscle. 10 more seconds, good job. Stay tall, roll your shoulders back. Head lights up, you got it. That's time. Okay, tricep push-ups. Drop those weights, get down to your mat. Elbows stay glued to the side of your body this time. You should feel this in the back of your arms. Three, two, one, let's go. Keep them in nice and close. Yes, elevated surface if you need. That's wonderful, way to go. Do that at home if you need it. You have a coffee table, a bench, a chair. That's sturdy enough, not soft, a countertop. 10 more seconds. Keep them close, don't let them come out. Three, two, one, good job. Okay, pick up those weights again, bent over row. We go in five seconds. Two, one, begin, bent over row, right here. 
Good, good, good. Should be feeling this in your back right here. Your lats, middle of your back. 10 more seconds. And time, good, bicep curls. Shake it if you need to. Okay, five seconds. Two, one, begin. All the way down, all the way up. If you're rocking like this, those weights might be too heavy. Keep it sturdy. Just soft, tiny bend in your knees, nothing locked. You got it, 10 more seconds. Don't let those weights pull you forward, stay tall. If you need to lower them, that's okay. And time, excellent. Drop your weights, tricep push-up. Keep those elbows in close this time, you can do it. Five seconds. Two, one, begin. Tricep push-up. You got it. You should be feeling the back of those arms. Oh, I see you shaking. That's beautiful. Good. Halfway. Look down at your mat, not underneath you, but just a little bit ahead of where your body is. Almost there. Five more seconds. You can do it. Get in a couple more. We'll get one more. One more. You can. All right. That's time. Good job. Back to the top, bent over rows again. This is our last time through this one. All right, pick up those weights. Three, two, one, let's go. Neck is neutral in alignment with the rest of your spine. If you're looking up, it's bent. If you're down here, it's bent. Just in alignment with your spine. Over halfway, you got it. Good, good. Five seconds, all the way through. Get in a few more. Yes, you can, you can. All right, good job, time. Bicep curls, shake it out if you need. Last time with these bicep curls. Okay, let's get ready. Three, two, one, begin. Good, good. All the way open, good job. You're halfway. Good, yes, look ahead of you. Ready, time, good, okay. Tricep push-ups, last one. Let's go in three, two, one, begin. You got this. Elbows close, all the way back up. Halfway. Keep going till the end. Time, good, good. All right, stay down here. We're gonna do one more core round. This time we're working our sides, the obliques. Come onto your wrists, up to your plank. You can be here on your, on your knee. You can come up all the way, hip dips, 30 seconds. You can um, stack those legs for the most challenge. We're gonna go to each side, 30 seconds each side. Two times through, ready? Three, two, one, begin. Your hand can be down on your hips. It can be up here. Doesn't really matter too much wherever you like it. Remember, you can always be on your knee. You can stagger those legs. You can stack them.
Five more seconds. Time, switch sides. Other side. Ready? Begin. Good, good. Keep breathing. Drop that knee if you need. Stagger those legs if you need. Stack them if you want more. Five seconds left. Almost there, don't stop. Time, good. Now you can stop. Flip it over the other side. We're doing each side one more time. All right, get ready. We go in three, two, one, begin. Good, good, lower that hip all the way down and back up. Just let it tap gracefully all the way back up. You got this. Keep going all the way through, you're halfway. If you need to come to your knee, totally fine. That's great, great option. You got this girl, five more seconds. Don't quit at this point. Time, good job. Flip over other side one more time. Three, two, one, begin. Good, good. You got it, halfway. Tell yourself you can do this. I know you're getting tired. You have less than 10 seconds. I know you can do it. Two, one, time, amazing. Okay, we've got two lower body moves, walking lunges, you know them. Hold your weights by your side. No break in between. We're stepping all the way through. We're not stopping. Keep going through after that. Bridge raises, we did our bridge hold after our cardio. This time we're gonna go all the way up, lower down, up, lower down. Add weight, 30 seconds each move, three times through. Pick up those weights for walking lunges. Three, two, one, begin. Good job, yep, stay tall, drop that knee nice and low. Perfect, yes. Halfway. Way to go all the way through it. I love that you stepped right through it, no break. Only five seconds left. Stay tall, that's time. All right, come to your mat for those bridge raises. Keep your weights, bring them to your hips. If you'd like, you can always do without, but add the weights if you can. And begin. Squeeze at the top before you lower down. Take the time to hold it. Lower down slowly with control. Don't just let it flop. Halfway. 10 more seconds. Weight is in your heels, pushing through your heels the whole time. Almost there, two, one, good, good. Okay, walking lunges again. Make your way up. And go. Nice job. Halfway. Five more seconds. Keep looking ahead of you. Keep your, your shoulders back. Time, good, okay. Bridge raises back to your mat.
Ready? Go. Right to it. Squeeze at the top. Slowly lower down with control. You can go really heavy on this. Your glutes are nice and strong. Halfway. Squeeze, squeeze before you lower down. Five seconds, big squeeze, slowly lower. Time. We're doing this one more time. One more. Back to the top, walking lunges. All right, ready? Begin. The 90 degree angle in that back leg. And the front leg too, 90-90, there it's all there. Over halfway. Way to go, girls. Two, one, time. You are done with walking lunges. Back to the bridges. Last time with these. All right, ready? Go, 30 seconds. Go heavy. Add that heavy weight. If you want a heavier weight, wave me down in person. I'll bring it to you at home. Get your heaviest weight. Halfway, big squeeze, slowly lower. Big squeeze, slowly lower. Five seconds all the way. Time, amazing. All right, last little bit before we cool down. You have got one more cardio burst. You have the same options as last time. Large lap in person, 300 jump rope. You can choose which one. Bridge hold when you're done. At home, 300 jump rope again. Bridge hold when you're done. Five minutes to get done. You got this. Get ready, get your equipment. Think about what you're doing. Okay, clock is starting. Go ahead and begin, girls. Good, find a steady pace. Make sure that your heart is pumping, whatever it is that you're doing to get there. Keep those elbows in close, small little flicks of the wrist. Nice job, you got this all the way through till the end. All 300, you have plenty of time. We're just a minute in, plenty of time to get there. Don't sell yourself short. You're in the home stretch. It's our last few minutes. Think of all the work you've done. Don't stop before the time ends. You can go, 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 good job. Keep those elbows in with or without your jump rope. The motion is the exact same. Nice work, nice work.
Keep those elbows in. You're halfway through this. Good, good, keep with that pace. You've got plenty of time to get it done. If you finish, go into that bridge hold, but don't rush through it. Get done what you need to get done. We're three minutes in. Nice job, girls. Go to that bridge hold if you're finished. We've got about 90 more seconds until our time is up. We're gonna hold that bridge until the end. Add weight if you can, push through your heels. Good, good. You got it. Squeeze, squeeze. Don't let those hips drop, bring them up. Weight is in your heels, nothing in your toes. They can wiggle, they can come up. We have one more minute. Have a little dance party. Say the alphabet backwards. Count your head, whatever you need to do to distract yourself. You got it, you got it. Squeeze, don't let them sag. They may be sinking a little bit since we're holding. Keep them up. We have 30 more seconds. You got this. Check where your hips are at. Are you squeezing as hard as you can? Is your weight all the way in your heels? Almost there, 15 seconds. If you wanna pulse it out these last 15, go ahead, pulse it out. Or hold it up, up to you. If you want a little movement, pulse, pulse. Almost there. Time, you did it. Way to go. Shake it out. You can stay there. Let's stretch. Go ahead and pull one knee in towards your chest. And then take that knee across your body, looking over your opposite shoulder. Bring your leg back in, straighten it. Heel is up towards the ceiling. Gently pull your leg in for a hamstring stretch. You can grab above or below the knee, just not on it. Pull it in a little bit more, really get that stretch. And slowly release. Opposite leg, knee comes into chest. Take it across your body, looking over opposite shoulder. And then bring it back to center, heel goes up to the ceiling. Pull your leg in for a hamstring stretch. And 
and then slowly release that leg, come up to seated, one arm across. And then overhead. And release and switch sides. Up overhead. Release, finish up by clasping those hands together behind you, pushing forward through your chest, opening up. Release, you guys are done. Thank you so much. You did amazing. Thank you girls, great job. Bye, I will see you next time.